Welcome back to Star Trek Online, everybody. I'm your host, the House Code Gamer, and today we're taking a look at the Justicar Star Cruiser, which somehow kind of looks better upside down. <laughs> then again, the Star Cruiser lineage kind of needs work. Now, let's see. Hmm. Odyssey will do. <coughs> the Star Cruiser lineage is actually one of the first non-series non-series starships that was introduced in STO. And by non-series, I mean wasn't introduced in any of the shows. Not even on a display. It's literally created by the people at STO. Which, of course, has something of a problem. Because it doesn't have a canon counterpart, there has been zero goddamn reason to... Well... Give these almost 14-year-old ships a facelift. That's right. This is a 14-year-old model. And... <sighs> it shows. It really shows. Hopefully... The introduction of a new Tier 6 model will convince the boys at STO to actually do something. And, you know, spruce up a little. I hate this thing. What is with the obsession with orange cap nacelles? Uh, before I get fixed up on that, I may as well get into the stats. Yes, I traded this thing, then I got rid of it. Then I brought it back. Five engineering, two science, three tactical. In other words, it's a tank boat. And it is very much a command ship. It even has a little command bar. As for its traits, you basically warp in, and then they suffer damage. And weapons go offline for almost 10 seconds. It's like the Picard Maneuver, except it's lethal. <laughs> As for its starship trait, Specialist Gear. Basically improves whatever ability you're using. Command, you taunt your target, which makes you, you know, more susceptible to being shot at. Intelligence, a random subsystem goes offline. Temporal Operations. Obviously, you gain one entropy, which makes it easier for you to harm them further. Miracle Worker, minus six power level. Of course, this does scale. Same with Pilot, <laughs> causing 16.7 defense rating to decrease. Of course, seeing as I'm on the ground... Well, it's kind of difficult to scale that, isn't it? And then there's the other problem. Oh, we'll be discussing you later. The fleet, just a car. Which I whose class I believe is named the Nomad. 
I am nomad. Someone had to say it. All it does is add a third in science console. Showing that, yes, this is not a DPS boat, though I'm pretty sure somebody's gonna try. It's a tank. Of course, almost every single one of these ships needs a redo. And the Justicar most certainly requires red cap nacelles. It needs to be done. No excuses. But what do you think? What do you think of this vessel? Do you have any builds in mind? If you want to get your hands on the fleet version, leave it out in the comments. Housecoat Gaming, signing off.